What's up, everybody? Back with Cigars and Whiskey for an extra review. It's the Obsidian White Noise Robusto. It's from the Dominican Republic. It's a wrapper is Ecuadorian Habano. The filler is Nicaraguan Dominican, and the binder is Dominican. It's a five and a half by fifty-four, and the cost is roughly four fifty to five dollars. Its construction similar to the regular Obsidian. It's very firm. Uh, the seams are very tight, close together. Uh, the foot's a little. Uh, uneven, maybe a possible a dull cut, and it's a triple cap. Stay tuned for the pre-light. On the pre-light, we're getting a nice draw. The draw is nice and clean. It's smooth, has, has notes of cedar and cocoa and a little bit of hay. And so, let's get into it. Welcome back, everybody, for the first third of the Obsidian White Noise Robusto. Uh, it's a great smoke output with a mild body of flavors, a bit of cocoa arrives, also a small amount of red pepper. There's a lot of sweetness in the first inch, and then the flare profile begins to change from mild to a medium. Please stay tuned for the second third. Welcome back everybody to the second third of the Obsidian White Noise Robusto. The uh, smoke is very slow. Uh, you can see the construction is holding up. Uh, it's not burning very evenly. But with the second, third, I'm starting to get a heavy cream component, which changes into a sweetness. And the cocoa really begins to move forward on the palate and shows itself. With the recent review of the City and Robusto, I would say that the white noise. Um, is a lot more flavorful. The profiles are changing a little better. It's got a better draw and a little more smoke. Stay tuned for the final third. For the final third of our review today, the Obsidian White Noise Robusto. As we're getting in towards the end of the second third and into the third third, we're noticing a little more cedar flavor on the back of the tongue. The sweetness and the earthiness are running, running the show with the cocoa just behind. Now moving to a full flavored cigar, and the construction is staying up pretty well. Uh, still an uneven burn, but it's still an enjoyable smoke. This is a good cigar. I would say I prefer this one over the regular Obsidian, uh, a little more flavor profiles. If you like this video, please hit like and subscribe, and always follow me on Facebook and Twitter. Thanks for tuning in to Cigars and Whiskey. Have a great day, have a great smoke, and we'll see you next time.